Well, it's always dangerous when Steve Spangler yes. shows it's up. Not, it's I'm nice. It's, it's, it's eggs and everything. But before we do that, i got to show you what happened. We were out in Littleton on la last Friday. Take a look mm -hmm. at the video here. This was a little thing called STEAM Fest. STEAM, Science, Technology, Engineering, Art, and Math. Out at Wilder Elementary. Take a look at this. The kids showed up to the Remax Balloon. Yeah. Isn't that fun? Awesome. Right there in the playground. Because the whole day was about flight. They had engineering things that they had to do. And so Alan Smith and the Remax team came out and brought that out because the kids didn't get to go up but they put their principal in it yeah. set the principal <laughs> up in the air and I was chanting cut the rope cut the rope <laughs> they were inside it was a maker fest so if parents are hearing things about maker events these kids were just using ordinary materials to try to uh, learn about flight and then why not the Littleton Fire Department and Littleton Police Department coming in and showing them the drones Droning them. a little oh, activity awesome. trying to get uh, kids to launch their own uh, paper airplane of course why wouldn't you want to launch ping pong balls and toilet paper Look at that. we've had things That's flying fantastic. in the air before and it's that fast moving air in that area of low pressure that teaches kids how to TP a home the correct way <laughs> which I think is fantastic and how to create uh, you know that piece but maybe the best thing is one of the kids dads is a pilot for our Denver police and he landed the helicopter wow. at the school wow. and why not a little explosion at the end that's it is that there, fun there are some kids who grow up in neighborhoods where they don't even learn how to TP a house I, uh, it, is, a sad. Sad. it is sad. focus on this take a look at this peeps everyone all right we so, have a peep. uh, so I don't know if you've heard right about now. this but this is crew Cruelty to peeps. Uh, where there's a huge wave. I'm sure it'll be on Facebook. So look here, you put your peeps here, and then this is one of those food sealers. So you right. know what I'm talking okay. about? So, so now if you pull the air out like this, watch what happens to the peeps. Now peeps are made out of uh, uh, marshmallows, and marshmallows have air in them. Look at how they begin to expand. Can you see this? They're looking for <gasps> They're stretching their little, little skin. Cracks. Can you see that? Uh, They're getting bigger well, and bigger me. and bigger. So you can take a little peep and turn it into a giant thing if you want to. And look at that. Isn't that sad? So is that pressurizing or unpressurizing? You're taking the air out. So we're pulling the air out, allowing the air in the peeps now to grow. Now watch this, which makes it kind of fun. Now, you see this? Watch. Don't take your eyes off. Three, two, one. Oh, oh, they're back. Does that happen there. to us when we get on airplanes? It is. When you get older, this is what happens to you. You kind of deflate, and that's how it works. Hey, uh, some people are saying, but that's too easy. What about something else? Yeah. So over on the website, over at stevespanglerscience.com, I'm going to put it up on Facebook. Look at this geode that's here. These are oh, eggs cool. that have been painted inside with borax mm. and allowed to dry. Look at the crystals that yeah. are inside that there. So you can make all of these egg geodes, and I'll give you the directions on how to with do that. borax. Which is kind of fun. Yeah, we're using borax. And then for our high school teachers, put on your safety glasses. Yeah. Look at this. I've done this with real eggs before, but I thought, what about with plastic eggs? So if you fill the egg with hydrogen gas, because that's a good idea. Don't hydrogen worry about gas. it. And then you just like, <laughs> see what I, I mean? That's a new way to Call do it. something with with <laughs> eggs, I uh, which the, I think uh, is fun. The Hindenburg had a hydrogen issue. Yeah, it's fine. Uh, so there's no problem there. And so the oxygen and the hydrogen kind right. of work their way together. <laughs> Hello. See how it burns <laughs> down? I noticed. So I just wanted something fun and exciting for Easter because it's so calm. This? Don't I, we? You I can read it later on if you want to. <laughs> Tell them about the website and about Facebook. Oh, Keep your safety glass. Well, why wouldn't you do it again? Because it, <laughs> why, why isn't it, that perfect? It goes to the ceiling. Why the delay? Because it's trying to get oxygen. When it pops, it's the perfect mixture of hydrogen and oxygen. Right. So in a chemistry class, chemistry teachers use this to teach stoichiometry. Oh, okay. Two parts hydrogen, one part oxygen. Yeah, yeah. You thought I was just messing around no, here. I, I was no, just wondering some real chemistry people. I was worried we were never going to get to stoichiometry. Look at this. Oh, look at those. Poor, oh, oh, do you see? Look at how sad those are. Oh, that got really Isn't that sad the saddest thing? Look at what you do to these peeps now. Look at how sad they are. They're horrible. Like wrinkled. Yeah, because we, we, we stretched them. But uh, we talked about pressure. We got some chemistry, some borax, and a little steam fest out at Wilder Elementary in Littleton. Do we really undergo any of that when we get on an airplane? Like yeah. any of that pressurization? Do we? You feel it in your ears a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, hey, people talk yeah. about their ankles swelling just yeah. a little tiny bit, right. which is kind of a good thing, too. Well, no, it's not. It's not good to have your ankles <laughs> swell. But why not? You're learning about pressure. I always feel so good when I've survived an episode. Nice. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait Just, you're fine, you're Put fine, you're fine. Oh. Tell them about whatever, whatever. It is the grand finale. It's a new one. I found this guy a little bit oh, earlier, really? which I thought was great. This guy burns down, but I think he's just a little tiny pop. What do you oh, think? Oh, it's still going to startle me. This is it. Fourth time, and it still startled, Steve, it still startled I know, me. I know, I know. Hang on. It's Thanks, sure. as Put always. Your pillow. There's always much more Thank information. You. 9news.com or go to stevespanglerscience.com. Thanks Bye, for guys. surviving. Thank you. Thank you. Be right back.